I stand in the position that the thing that would influence the future of the RC and the hobby the most in the positive way is most probably creation and adoption and usage popularity of the open standard of the digital HD FPV protocol, including hardware and software. The situation we have right now kinda kinda sucks. We have HD0, which is digital, uh, digital analog, whatever. We have DJI FPV and we have Walksnail. And all three of those systems, in many ways, bringing much better quality and uh, general experience than the analog FPV, are not compatible with each other. You cannot use Walksnail goggles with the DJI uh, VTXs, VTXs from Walksnail, from the DJI with the goggles from the Walksnail and so on and so on. They are completely different uh, solution to the basically the same problem. What would both allow the prices to go down and the adoption to improve and the in general experience of everything is that if one of biggest players on the market could agree on the open standard for everything. That would be just fantastic. That would be exactly the same that we had for the analog. Different companies manufacturing compatible hardware with each other. I know. I know this is like my wish and this will never come true. I'm fully aware of this fact. And the, the, the reason is very simple. Because the analog FPV was just the adoption of the standard used for the CCTV. This was just open standard, like starting since the beginning of the television, this, uh, PAL and TSC only transmitted over 5.8 gigahertz uh, radio, no processing, no magic at all. Here, DJI created their own, Walksnail created their own, HD0 created their own, and nobody really wants to share with anyone because of the amount of money that went into this thing and how much uh, it costed, so we have to keep it closed because if we want to disinvest meant to be profitable at the end. So I'm pre I am I know that will never, never happen. I know that there are like attempts to make the open source implementations of it, the open standards, uh, at least open systems for the digital FPV. Uh, but they have, all of them have one biggest, big problem is that they are not supported by any of the big players uh, in our hobby. DJI is not interested, Walksnail is not interested, HD0 is not interested, uh, nobody is really interested. And that means you cannot buy the hardware, uh, at least easily buy the hardware that is reliable, simple to use and cheap. You have to experiment with uh, those open IPC ideas left and right. And this is not really something that the person that just want to go on a flight can do. That will just not, not, not ever happen. So that's unfortunately a bummer. But it would be amazing. It would be amazing seeing uh, the FPV unite one more time, having the single video transmission system for everyone. Maybe one day, I doubt, but maybe one day that might happen and that would be fantastic.